man. I like I said, I come across so much stuff. Like some of the stuff I get from my man Jay Weber. I get stuff that people send me. I look at some of Paris Procopus's articles with News Undone, my business partner. Um, this this story is hilarious because I heard this dude was in his drawers eating chicken wings, making business deals. Listen to this. This is from Google. The dude that started FTX, um, basically FTX, they were like a crypto company or something like that. And I think that, what's the guy? I know his name is not Bankman, Freed or Fried or Freed. Fried like fried chicken wings. That would be hilarious. Hold on saying that, um, it said Bankman, Freed. This is hyphenated. What? They said he was scheduled to testify before a panel was arrested based on an indictment in the U.S. that was unsealed shortly after the hearing started. The United States Attorney's Office from the Southern District of New York charged the disgraced crypto executive with eight criminal counts, conspiracy to commit wire fraud and security fraud, individual charges of securities fraud, wire fraud, money laundering, conspiracy to avoid campaign and finance regulations, and they should throw in another charge because this mother who was sitting in his drawers on the computer getting paid. They said it was billions of dollars. This is what trips me out. They said this was massive years-long fraud. But the thing that throws me off the most outside of all of this is how on God green, God's green earth does anybody put that much money into some sh- that no one can explain to me what it is. This is what happens when you ask the average person about crypto. Hey, how are you doing, man? Very nice to meet you. Would you say your name is Evan? Evan? Oh, I'm sorry. Your name is Ian. Okay. All right, Mr. Ian. Oh, last name Jordan. Okay, Ian Jordan. We prefer to go by first names around here, bro. My name is Bankman, and this is what I'm going to do for you. Look, brother, I know you got, I don't know, let's just say you got this $100,000 of, of, of quote-unquote real money. You can take this and you can you can invest it here. Let me tell you what we do at Bankman Freed. Um, excuse the chicken wings. Um, what we're going to do here is I'm going to take that $100,000 of your money and you work hard. I know you got multiple businesses and I heard your podcast. Oh my God, you are the world's smartest podcaster on God's green earth. And I'm going to take that $100,000 and I'm going to turn it to 100 million crypto dollars. And what crypto really is, my friend, do you have a pen? Okay, great. Write this down. What better yet, don't write any of this down due to the markets possibly changing. So what this does is it's kind of like a digital currency, you know, like when you buy coins from Minecraft, how when you put real money, you can apply it to that world. We're going to go ahead and put your money into the meta database. Blah, blah, blah. Sorry to go on along with that, but that's how it sounded when I was like watching these crypto videos and these fools could not explain to me precisely what crypto actually is. And I'm sitting here thinking, thank God that I did not partake in any of that, because if I did, I would be broke. Apparently, dude's going to be in jail for like another 10 to 20 in there with Bernie Madoff and the rest of the people. I'm out. Next topic.